take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Go to Settings, Cellular, Cellular Data Options. If you see this screen, your device has 5G activated. If you don't see this screen, contact your carrier to confirm that your plan supports 5G. Turn on airplane mode, then turn it off. Make your mark, take our lead. The main selling point of the iPhone 12 is 5G wireless connectivity, but there are many aspects to that network. If you see just the 5G symbol, that means you're connected to standard 5G on the sub-6 GHC spectrum. This spectrum can be faster than LTE but slower than MM wave and higher frequency 5G bands. Make your mark, take our lead. If you purchased your iPhone 12 through your carrier or with Apple including carrier activation you shouldn't have an issue with your SIM card. In the case of T-Mobile that supports what's called standalone 5G, a new SIM card may be required. Take our lead. If you don't already have a 5G SIM, you'll need this to use 5G, yes. This can be used alongside another SIM card in your iPhone 12, but at present the iPhone 12 will not support 5G if a customer is using dual SIM. It will work with an eSIM only. Let's help you make your mark. Go to Settings, Mobile, Mobile Data Options. If you see this screen, your device has 5G activated. If you can't see this screen, contact your network provider to confirm that your plan supports 5G. Turn on airplane mode and then turn it off. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.